started to get stronger, bro, both in my spirituality and my emotions. Um, and physically, I started to get stronger. Now, as these three started to align and as they started to strengthen, I started to, my, my sacral st- chakra start, started to align. It started to um, activate. And I found myself wanting to create and wanting to build from my own creations. You know, I I saw things that other people were doing and I got inspired, you know. But the inspiration, it wasn't an inspiration of looking to take. It was an inspiration that was looking to give. And so I wanted to create something of my own from my own creations that I could give back to the world um, out of my energy. And so that is where I started. It's like the more I work out, the more I worked out, um, the more energy I got. It's like, I'm just up, I'm up at the crack of dawn and (laughs) I'm just bubbling with all this energy. It's like, where do I put it? Where do I put it? It's in there, but it's not going wild or anything. It just wants to be put into something useful. Um, so I started, I went, I wanted to be put back in, it wanted to be put into something useful. And so I went back into the business that I had create. I started to create a couple of years ago and I started to, I started there. All of these different designs. If you go to my website, um, which is in the description box and it's also in my bio, um, I don't know at what time you're gonna actually you're actually getting this reading if it's at the beginning of the channel um, me starting the channel or the middle but I have a lot of different designs that I've created from my spiritual journey that I've created on my own that I look to put out distribute into the world um, shirt um, clothing designs shirt designs um, yeah, it's a brand, and the brand, it is my brand. It is everything that is in me, divinely touched, divinely guided, divinely protected. And so I am the brand, and I want to distribute my energy so that I can divinely guide, divinely protect, you know, with my energy that I put into my creations. And so it is. This is why um, it's so important that if you are going to start a business or if you are going to do something or want to create something, make sure that you're doing it for you and not just because it's trending. Because if you're genuinely doing it for you, there are many benefits that comes with this consistency and dedication. Um, those are some of the main things that come with it. If you're doing it because someone else is doing it, you're not going to be persistent or dedicated because the person that you're watching and trying to follow, what about when they get discouraged and when they or if they feel as or if they feel as though it's not working for them anymore, then what? Then you're going to lose your inspiration because you weren't feed you wasn't feeding off of your own inspiration and your own creativity. You was feeding off of someone else's. And so we're now now where you where do you go? You know, so it's very important to be mindful that, you know, whatever it is that you're doing, you're doing it because it's something that you want to do. Like you can't want to be a personal trainer because somebody else is really good at personal training. You know, you can't just want to start a cooking business because somebody else is doing the cooking business and it works out for them. No, you got to actually have a passion for these things. You have to have a passion for cooking, you know, for, for, you have to have a passion for working out. It has to be a, a lifestyle for you. It has to be something that you already are passionate about, that you love to do. That way, you know, no matter what, what obstacles are thrown at you, not, that way, no matter what, 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 what comes up against you, you will always be able to resurrect. Like if the idea doesn't work out for you the first time, you're not going to get discouraged and go try to find another idea. No, you're going to sit down. You're going to, you're going to analyze. You're going to figure out what happened. Where did I go wrong? Put the pieces together. You're going to get your ass up and you're going to try again. 
You know, this is what it means to be a creator. This is what it means to be a leader. It means not giving up because it didn't work out the first time. Don't live off somebody else's dream and expect to build wealth off of somebody else's dream. It has to be your own dream. It has to be something that you want. And so with this with this um, process, this is how I resurrected myself from an eternal death that was that that was set up for me. This is how I resurrected step by step. I started with my spirituality. I then start I then went to my emotions. I sat with my emotions and I wanted to know why I was feeling the way I was feeling. Um, and then once I came to agreement with that, I then went to my physical. Physically I I wanted to build my body back up physically. And once I aligned and I strengthened myself spiritually, emotionally, and physically, my financial (laughs) stability, it is impeccable. I am building an empire that will reach the nations. I am, I do stand in that. I stand in that wholeheartedly and it's just, it's a process. It's a day by day process, but I'm here for it. I'm here for it and I'm not giving up, you know. I I work every day. I work every day 